I'm your anchor, Gladys Quesada, and these are the news. The Bolivarian Republic of Venezuela restored diplomatic relations with Honduras, following Xiomara Castro's swearing in as the new female president of that Central American country. The first step to reestablish relationships between both nations was taken by Venezuela, with the arrival of the official delegation sent by President Nicolás Maduro to participate in the presidential inauguration ceremony. Shortly after arriving in Tegucigalpa, the head of the Venezuelan delegation, Governor of Miranda State, Hector Rodríguez, stated that the first thing of this country would do was to send a new ambassador to order, in order to restore political relations and the ideas of unity. Rodríguez, who was accompanied by Foreign Minister Félix Plasencia, Vice Minister Rander Peña, and the Minister of Women Margarot Godoy, announced that Godoy will be the new ambassador in Honduras. This embassy is received in terrible conditions. Unfortunate what the farce does, what the deception does. Today we have rescued the diplomatic relations of the Bolivarian Republic of Venezuela with the Honduran people with the democracy that has become president, this great woman from Latin America. Today, our diplomatic relations are re-established and together we will create a clear path for the unity of Latin America, the unity between Honduras and Venezuela, between our people. It is a wonderful moment, Governor, to rescue this moment and to break definitely with that deception. It is a day of celebration, a day of great celebration, a day of solidarity. We must remember Commander Chavez and recognize the commitments, thanks to all.